Hey everyone, it's Darby from Blue Television Games. Today we'll be looking at another Super Mario Maker mod. This one puts Dry Bowser into the game, replacing regular Bowser in Super Mario Bros. 1, Super Mario Bros. 3, and Super Mario World. This mod was made by Willy Maker, and the sprites were made by KGK64, Ultima Warrior 232, and JX44444. That's a lot of fours. Anyways, I'll put the credits in the description below along with a link of where you can download the mods. All the Dry Bowser mods are currently in separate files. I put them all in one to make the video a bit easier to record. If the creator hasn't already or if they want a copy with all three together, I'll gladly give them one to make the download a little easier for everyone. Let's take a look at Dry Bowser in all three styles and then play a level or two with the mod applied. Let's get started. Alright, to get things started off, let's try out Dry Bowser in Super Mario Bros. 1 style. Alright, so he'll shoot out blue fireballs instead of the standard red ones. Here he is in Super Mario Bros. 3 style, where he'll try to jump and stomp on you. I love the pixel art and the animations in this style. Here he is in Super Mario World style, where he'll throw bones at you just like a dry bones. He'll also toss them into the sky like so, and then once they reach the top of the screen, they'll come tumbling back down onto Mario. We'll quickly look at Dry Bowser with wings, although we're not really going to see much of a difference. Here he is in Super Mario Bros. 1, here he is in Super Mario Bros. 3, and finally here he is in Super Mario World. Jump on the axe and take him out. Here's Dry Bowser in a clown card in Super Mario World. He'll throw out bombs so we can grab him, throw him up, and bonk him on the head. And here we have Super Mario Bros. 3 Dry Bowser in a clown car. And finally, Super Mario Bros. 1, Dry Bowser in a clown car. And now to get a really good look at this pixel art, we're going to put a mushroom on Dry Bowser in all three styles. Here he is, of course, in Super Mario Bros. 1. Here we have the blown up Super Mario Bros. 3 Dry Bowser. Really, really love the pixel art. It looks so cool, especially blown up. And then finally, we have Super Mario World Dry Bowser with a mushroom applied as well. He's definitely pretty scary looking in Super Mario World style. All right, now that we've taken a closer look at Dry Bowser in all his different forms, let's go ahead and try out a couple different levels with the mod applied. All right, this first level is called Bowser Run. A while back, I made a mod called the Chainsaw Maniac mod, where I replaced Bowser with the Chainsaw Maniac, and I request that people make levels where Bowser chases you. This is one of those levels. I don't remember it real well. I don't remember how good or bad it is. But we're going to try it out right now. All right, so when we eat the bones and shoot them back, we shoot out lava bubbles. It'd be kind of cool if you changed those to bones as well, at least for this mod in particular. Uh-oh, <laughs> now we got a Magic Koopa. I'm not sure how long the level is. The timer is kind of low. <laughs> oh, man, it's getting kind of spammy. Get a little spammy with the enemies. Oh, there's the axe. Okay, we're at the end. We got this. All star, easy peasy. Jump on the axe and finish the level. All right, for the next level, it's called It's From Bowser. It's another level that was submitted for my Chainsaw Maniac mod. Sadly, these are both gonna be Super Mario World style, uh, but I don't know a lot of levels where you're seeing Bowser the entire time. A lot of levels just have Bowser at the end, so I thought these would be cool levels to test out the mod. We could take them out with the... Nope, oh, nope, we can't now because we lost our cape. <laughs> I like these levels in Super Mario World in particular because Bowser will chase you around and if you make it a slow auto scroller, it can get pretty tense at times. I think as long as we stand places where he can't land on us, it'll definitely make it a little easier. And of course there's nothing in that question mark block. Uh, I want this one over here. Get out of the way, dry Bowser! Dang it. <laughs> I think we're gonna die. Alright, we'll never know what's in that question mark block. Unless of course we do die. A one up. Well, that's nice, but it's not going to help us in this situation. And he's getting closer and closer. No, 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 no. <laughs> now we got to get by him. You know he's going to jump as soon as we jump. Oh, okay, we made it. Give me the mushy. Okay, now we got a little insurance with that mushroom. Oh my. <laughs> uh, if we can hang on to the mushroom, I'll feel a little more confident. Once again, not sure how long we got left in the level. Okay, we got a cape now. A bunch of clown cars. Oh man, he landed in one too. That's really cool. <laughs> and the clown car charged up will spit out bones. That's pretty cool. Right, we could probably take him out to make things a little bit easier. Maybe. <laughs> oh man, he's kind of off screen now. 
I think we kind of got past them, so this shouldn't be too hard now. Well, sadly, somewhere along the line, Dry Bowser got held up a bit, so it looks like we're not going to have much of a challenge and not see him much more for the rest of the level. Let's just wait here and grab that sweet, sweet one up. Alright guys, that's our look at the Dry Bowser mod for Super Mario Maker. Let me know what you think of the mod in the comments below. Once again, check the description if you want to download and try out the mod for yourself. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, and if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time, I'll see you around.